Yes, people, what's happening? Nice one for coming back to the Fuse UK. It's much appreciated as always. Tonight's guest we've got on the show, Gary the Fox. Fox, how you doing, brother? I don't know where that Gary the Fox Fox come from. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> it's, I always had him a short run as pro, you know, the Fox, but that just sounds a bad old nickname. I'm going to have to think of some of that, I thought when I heard said, of it, like, eh? Doesn't sound right, does it? No, <laughs> not. It's just like everyone used to call me the Fox, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but I'll think of some of I remember thinking yeah. in the ring, fuck, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> <laughs> the wrecking ball. <laughs> yeah. Come here. But, uh, I thought we'd start, mate, by uh, talking about just before the fight. And because um, yeah. this was a total different camp for you, when it going down back to your natural way. Yeah. And how it did felt, you make it? Felt more, it, felt, it felt like back to camp. It felt like back to, you know, like last few weeks of the of the camp. I was thinking about food. I was fucking, you know, like screenshotting bits of cakes and that way, like, you know, cutting <laughs> weight properly. Like, I just didn't feel like that before. I was like constantly full. And I was having these two hard strength weight days and then days off after the strength days. Didn't really feel like a fight. I felt constantly full and I don't know, just, it was just different. Like, I didn't have that like sort of, you get a different thing about you when you, you know, when, when you're hungry for a fight. If you get hungry, you're like, you've got like a bit of a fucking, yeah, sharper people and blunt. You know, you've got a fight coming up. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, you know, in the last week in in the in the gym, um, in fact, I was like making the weight, and that just felt like that with the around like Tommy Ward, and that you know, it just like it was like it was like back to the old days. You know what I mean? Because I was in there with Martin before doing my weight cuts and that, and um, like you said, it wasn't a major weight cut really. Um, you know, I was I was on the weight where I wanted to be for five weeks before I needed to cut. You know, like yeah. drop the fluid. So it just shows me that that's my weight. You know what I mean? And and I felt I felt strong and. Do you know, I felt, I felt, you know, I felt like I'd be hard to put away. You know what I mean? Yeah. And did, did you feel good on the scales and that as well? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Well, I, I actually, what I done was when, I, when, when I do, when I do, I'd come right on the scales when I check, which I check with fellows. Mine were bang on the same, and I come about a pound under. So I had like a bit of a drink in that. But then on the way down to the, to the way, and I was sipping away, and I just went, and so I'd come on, I'd come a bit over. But, yeah. but when I jumped in the sauna, I was just pissing out me, like, you know, within three or four minutes. I was, and but but then it said I weighed like a pound or something under, which I, I was only in the sauna 10 minutes. So I, I don't know if there was a little problem with the scales, but at least I know, like, I've done it now and I know when to start cutting. I've like, it's all refreshed in my mind now. You know what I mean? So yeah, it, like, yeah. it'd be better. You know, in the beginning, it was like, oh, I've never made this way for a few years, where now I've made it. So it's, it's not going to be like in my head, like a little problem, like wondering, how, am I going to be able to do it? So at least it, it's just all building for you know what I mean it's going to be easier next time yeah 100% mate and what were your thoughts on uh, like full respect to him by the way but what were your thoughts on Aiden Sheriff coming in for uh, I was, I was a bit I, I was a bit well to be fair it was it was, it was my pal it was, it was, he'd, he'd come back down watching where I didn't, I didn't <laughs> even know me he fought, he fought me up here and said, I'm on my way back down here. I, mean, I, I, didn't have a, I didn't have a jar of glue, honestly, I thought. But obviously, I've got a fair play to him for going because, like I said, at least I found out what was going on. And maybe he's like, you know, it's one of them things where it's down for him, for my pal to have, 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 you know, have my best interest in that, really, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Because five kilos is just under the stone. Um, it would have been different if he was, you know, big and muscly and raw bone. You could see, he wasn't like carrying, the weight he was carrying wasn't like, you know, muscle and it wasn't like, yeah. Where it's going to make him any advantage, you know what I mean? But he, he apologised now, he's, he's he's bang on, you know what I mean? But I did think he'll be a little bit more professional, like, because it's what he does often enough. Yeah. But he apologised now, and he got a couple of key off, and do you know what I mean? It's one of them things. Um, but yeah, fair play to him for taking the fight and all that, yeah. And another thing, he come out and had a go and fired some shots, which I was thinking, I was, wasn't really expecting that, and, but I played like, that's what I like. I like someone to come and have a go, and, and, and that's why I found, you know, I, I caught him pretty sharp on do you know what I mean because he come for a bit of a fight yeah 100% and how did you find the whole set up at Newcastle yeah I, I said I did go to watch the one before that but a lot different when you're fighting um, and, I, and I enjoyed the full thing uh, yeah, I, I loved it like I said it was just all back just a full fight camp you know it's just it was all the shows of mint you know what I mean um, yeah. I, the first time I just was a bit I wasn't really known as much, you know what I mean, What was what, how it was going to work out, but they just like the pro shows, really, you know what I mean? Yeah. And there's a few similar faces from the pro shows, you know, the people I know and that there, so, yeah, it just feels like back in the old days, and I love it. Yeah, you had the, uh, good support with you as well, didn't you? The fucking yeah. crowd were yeah. for you. Yeah, yeah, 
yeah, go to Portmouth. You know, uh, I got a few T-shirts and that, and they all have the T-shirts on. Some good for. I want to put a few on my pages. Some good pictures, like with the lads with the tops on. They've got them on the fucking bulldogs and that. They look, they look mint. You know what I mean? Yeah. Must be a good feeling, though, mate, to do what you're doing and having all these people behind you, backing you and rooting yeah. for you. Oh, it does, yeah. I think everybody knows that. Uh, I don't know, like, in the boxing, it, it, I think it's, it, it's still everywhere, boxing, unless they're massive fights. The shows aren't up, what, they're not, nothing like what they were. Um, there's a lot of, like, fights where you know the winner um, and there's fights what you want to see happen and they're happening where they see it's just a bit of a different... Uh, and everybody knows this is what my game, this is what I'm all about, you know, like... When I first told them all this is what I was going to be doing, there was a lot of people like, you know, they were bang up for it. Where if I said I was turning back over and having having a few more pro fights, didn't know I'd be back in fighting another few journeymen. And do you know what I mean? It's just nothing, yeah. no like, do you know what I mean? Where if I, where this is completely different. Where yeah, it's like something fresh for everybody. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, and there's no there's no hardening in this one, is there? <laughs> no, it's like every fight's exciting. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. And uh, on the actual night of the fight, going into the um, the fight with Aiden Sheriff, did you expect it to be over as quick? Um, I didn't. I didn't. I thought if I catch him, he's he's going to go. But I thought, is he going to come for to be caught, or is he going to yeah. be on the move and be mobile? You know what I mean? Um, but he come, he come out and he fight. Like I said, look, I've got. A, I've got a shine, you know what I mean. So he did he caught, like I said. But that's what I like. You know what I mean? I, 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 well, that's what that's what that's what gets me into it. Do you know what I mean? And, and it just bounced off. You know what I mean? I um, <laughs> I'll take some, I'll take some beating, like. And obviously, your division—it's not a very large division at the moment in the uh, UK with the BKFC, but it's getting bigger. It's getting there. Yeah. But yeah. Been a bit of back and forth as well on some comments between. I know it's all yeah. respect in that. You've got a lot of respect for each oh, other, but we're over there. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. yeah. yeah like, we had a few words. To, to be honest with you. He lent me his gum shield. He's a nice lad. He's, he's just like where I am. He's a game as fuck. I like game lads. I like fighting men. You know what I mean? That's what he is. Um, yeah. Do you know, but fucking about... Just before the fight, before the interval, before the main card started, I fucking went in my bag and, where's the gum shield at? For, for my ass. Why, why did you get me gum shield off the mic? It's down to me, really. Just double check the fucking bag. I was calling her all sorts. And, uh, and they just come over and said, listen, I'll, I'll come and give me gum shield straight after. I, I fucked it, like, I put it in the water too long and ruined it. And uh, Robert Barry lent me his. But like I said, was, we all, you know, we all in the same game and, and like, massive respect to me coming, you know. That, that's how it, that's how I come to message me in the beginning. I just said, hey, th- thanks for that, mate. You know what I mean? How did you feel and stuff? And that's when, you know, we where, where it all started, do you know what I mean? Yeah, because it'd be a, a big fight, that wouldn't it? Obviously, it's yeah, like a lot of Derby, two big names. Cross paths, you know what I mean? I think the same day of the fight, I'd call up Fen Shops in an article, and uh, call for something. And then I'd come over, how are you doing, Fox? And all that good luck. And he come and got a picture with me. And he went, look at this one here. And he scrolled on his, his last photo. It was Robbie Brown. He said, if you were here a minute ago, Robbie was just in his car back. So we actually <laughs> crossed paths, you know what I mean? So that's how yeah. close we are together. Do you know what I mean? So it, it, then there's a lot of interest because of that, you know what I mean? Where... Do you know, it's 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 like a lot of I've had a lot of phone calls and that. Do you know what I mean? Where they're the fights people like, aren't they? Yeah, like I'll put it on my Instagram earlier, mate. I've only put half of the messages on it. It's just message yeah. after message after message, ah. mate. This might happen. Yeah. They all want to see who it. They, who they favour? Who they Who's getting the most? Uh, who are they thinking? Uh, on I think on mine, it's slightly going towards you. And I think there's another couple. It's like a, it's balancing out in it on other yeah, channels. Yeah, of course, yeah, of course. And the more as fight, like say, if if a fight like that come, was to come, they just get the closer and closer you get. People, you can swear, can't you? You know, yeah. I've done it with with the boxing fights. I've sort of like thought a certain fighter all the way through, and then just last minute thought there's certain things, and you think, fuck me, I'm thinking him now. You know, you can just sort of yeah. swear, can't you? Yeah, they're the they're, like say they're the interesting fighter, aren't they? Yeah, is, is that what you're really wanting now, like Foxy? Just to have well, the just, well, I, just, I wasn't like wanting any, like I said, just I'm out and I'm wanting anybody in my way, anybody in my way. That's what I'm wanting. Um, I wasn't just thinking I want him. Listen, the lad's doing, he's doing well. I like what he's doing, and, and his name's blown up. I'm not like gonna piss in his chips and say, I want to fucking, do you know what I mean? I'm not that type of person, but now now that's being put up there and this bit of back and forth, I think that's what fight, what should be in, in my eyes. I, I, I mean, I didn't read, I didn't see this. Chip Chase getting the ring out because I was on after. Um, right. I didn't know that was a sort of looking like a done deal or nothing. I didn't really know that. that. 
at the time. I, I, um, and when I've watched back on the on the fight, it cuts it up. You don't see it either. But I've seen on on Inst- on Instagram like uh, them having a face off. But I didn't know none of this. Um, but I, I mean, I just think uh, now this has been brought up, and in this all this what's happening now. In my eyes, I think um, I think it should be next to me. Yeah, it, it would be because a um, I just feel like anything can happen in bare knuckle, and I think like a loss for any of us takes makes it not as big fight. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I understand what you mean. What What do you think as of uh, Robbie as a fighter out of the fights that you've watched him in so far? Yeah, well, you didn't really see much. I, I haven't really seen a great lot of them, uh, but I did. I did obviously. I watched that fight back. Um, and I seen the fight what you just went under the fucking thing, but I mean that that's yeah, hard to go off that with a yeah, like yeah. a stand up fight. Um, but I might, I, um, yeah, but I mean, like I said, if I was to, if it was to be on, I'd, I'd be very confident in the winning. Do you know what I mean? Um, I just I don't feel like he could, um, in the time he would have, I don't see how he could, like in his boxing, or like you know, his stand up fighting, like punching, he could. Like sort of improve enough to beat me. Like in the same way, if we said in three months' time, if we'd have an MMA fight, I don't think I'd be able to learn enough to beat them on the ground. Do you get yeah. what I mean? This is my game. This, and I've been doing this for years and years. You know what I mean? Yeah. Where, so I'm very, be very confident. Yeah, and what what weight would the fight be at? Would it be at well, one four five? Well, yeah, that, that that's the weight I'm doing, and that like. When this is what I would first come about when I when when I said, "Oh, how did you feel?" I said, "What weight are you doing? Uh, yeah. Like, is is this it? You know, I this was heavy for you." I said, "You know, what weight are you doing?" And he, he sort of hit us with, "I'll fight anyone anyway," sort of thing. And that was like to me, like, <laughs> you know, which is fucking fair play to him. I like the lad, man. I think his game is fucking. I like game people. You know what I mean? Yeah, like I said, he's uh, taking me out after him. He's fucking he, he's game, and he, he, and that's what I like about him. You know what I mean? Like yeah, said, it's all, it's all, it all, if it all got fucking, however it got, it gets heated for fights. You know, when you face offs and stuff, and you, you know, you, 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 you start to find hate. But, but after that, it's fucking, you know, I mean, to have a fight. Like, I have friends that a lot of fighters have fought. You know what I mean? We're in the same game. Um, but like I said, um, yeah, like a one, one, four, five is my weight where, where I'm contending at. So I, I, it's not a fight where I'm thinking I want to fight him uh, and I'll come even further down just to fight him. It's not him. So much I'm after. I just anybody in that way. Do you get what I mean? Yeah, Any, anyway, anyone that's going to elevate. Think, yeah. I just think it's like with there being a not. I just well look at the look at the look at the, how the words blown up. Do you know what I mean? It would be a massive fight. I mean, it's all about the fucking pork, isn't it? We get good money. Yeah, and like you say there with uh, Robbie Light being game, and that, I think that's what makes this an interesting fight because yeah, it's met- game as fuck. This is game as fuck. Like I said, when I said what way you do, he said I fight anyone anyway. I mean, you can't get no more fucking. Like I'll, I'll fight you as the neck, can you? He's more. Like that's like, that's like all attitude as well, though, isn't it? That's I'm what the same attitude. Like, I mean, like I, I was the same when, 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 the, when my first fight was at welterweight, and that was like massive for me. Like what, fucking over eleven stone weighing day. I mean, like, but but because I, I just thought with with gloves off, I'll fight any cunt. But like, it's just you don't <laughs> realize like the minutes in the rounds and then and then if you know if any, the way he fought the rounds slip away and then and there's a, eventually an end to that fight it's not like a street fight where you go and go and go do you get what I mean yeah. do you know yeah. it's, so and I just thought to myself do you know but don't don't get us wrong if a big fight come at that way I'd, I'd take it do you know what I mean but I feel like I just I want to I want to see what I can do with this this in this division do you know what I mean try and take a few out do you yeah, know try yeah. and look at some titles and stuff do you know what I mean Definitely, mate. You're best off being in the way that you're comfortable in, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it, it was just all the learning, like I say, all the learning. Um, but I, you know, because I thought bare knuckle, I've done bare knuckle for fucking for like for years and years and years, and and I've never like sort of thought, oh, he's too big for me. You know what I mean? Yeah. And um, so that's why I just I didn't care in the first fight. Um, but then obviously I've learned from that and thought, you know, best off being in my own division and and even it out. You know what I mean? Yeah, definitely, mate. Did you uh, manage to catch up on the rest of the card? What did you think of um, your pal Ben's performance? Yeah, it was just two game lads, hell of a fight. Um, look, look, Ben got caught with a good shot, and I don't know if he shook it on, didn't seem to shake it off for me. Yeah. It was good, he, good kept out. Going, he kept it going, and do you know what I mean? Dad pulled it and dug a good fight out. Get, get, like I said, fair credit to both of them. Um, you know, Ben will be back. 100% he will, mate. 
And uh, when are you thinking about being out next? I know there's two cards coming up. Are you hoping to get on one of them ones, yeah? I'm hoping to get on the Leeds card, like, mate. You know what I mean? Uh, I love Leeds anyways. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I, I love Leeds, mate. I love the Mighty Whites, mate. So I wouldn't mind fighting in Leeds. I was sick of watching the last card in Leeds and not being honest. You know what I mean? Yeah, I can imagine, mate. I remember, like, because you, you go to all the footy matches and that, don't you? Yeah, you know, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, I love, I love it. Like I said, I was, it was 10 years ago, I didn't even like football, mate. I thought I was for puffs, you know what I mean? But now, just going to games, <laughs> you know, I just absolutely... I like, I, I look, I, it's like, you know, when the... Uh, it's like, I just look, like, I, I like... I was all for the Premiership last season, but like this season, I lo- I probably don't even watch. I'm not like I don't even watch the Premiership. I just watch the Championship. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. I, I'm all about like the. I just, I just love Leeds. You know what I mean? Le- Leeds has made me like football. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely, mate. And so, are you out of uh, um, training now? When, when are you getting back at it? Yeah, I'm, I'm busting to get back. Like you say, I'm good for injuries, and I brought, like I had a good, strong, like hard camp where like I do need a bit of a. Um, a rest, you know what I mean? But I'm, 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 I've, I've just had a, like, a just easy week doing nothing really, but a couple of saunas and that. But, uh, yeah, I'll just start maybe doing a little bit next week, just a couple of days away, but now no too much, you know what I mean? Because I, I'm, I don't know the full date, like the exact date. I think it's the 21st or the 28th or something. Or I'd say it'd be, it's a good 14 weeks or something anyway. So I don't want to yeah. step up. I don't want to start hard now, you know what I mean? Cause you, it's, you need a bit of rest, you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely, mate. And um, where can everybody follow you on Instagram and that now? Is yeah. it still Gary Dot Fox? Yeah, Gary Dot Fox, uh, BKFC uh, dot LUFC. Yeah. Yeah, sweet. And uh, is there anything else you want to share with us, mate? Before we wrap it up, any sponsors or anything like that? Oh, I've got my sponsors at the ready, man. I know what I'm doing. Now, don't I? You know what I mean? I'm getting used <laughs> yeah. to this. I'm getting Prepare used to this. Out. Yeah. There's Aramark Road Markings, uh, Greenways Landscaping, Home Pro UK. Northern HV, the Merlin Pub in Billingham, CS Paving and Groundworks, JJ Hardy and Sons, James Roofing, and CM Motor Trading. Custy, mate. But well, after, um, and I'll we'll give stay- it, just a shout with kids as well Shannon Jackson, Nate, and Lara. And also, me, my cousin's little girl wants a shout, and she, she's there, uh, Skylar Cowie. She's doing it, she's coming for her first amateur fight soon. She's a little machine, so good luck to her. Oh, good luck. Class. It's mint, in it, when you go and watch the kids in the amateurs? Yeah, and that. About, I've said I was going to do a bit with her on the pads and stuff, but I've just been busy for myself, you know what I mean? But uh, I, I, I'll, be, I, I'll, be, I'll be able to do it a bit. So I, like, I, like, I like having the kids out, you know what I mean? It's, it's a good, and that's where, that's where I like, you know, the, sometimes, like I say, the, the minute with the professional boxing, that seems fucked. But, like, the, the, the young, innocent kids who was just starting out, that's where I like, you know what I mean? I, I, I can enjoy them once, you know what I mean? Especially when you know who they are. Yeah, I, th- I think pro boxing is fucked now, mate. It's absolutely yeah, fucked. Yeah, it, 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 it shot itself in the foot too many times, you know what I mean? It's just there's too too much going on and it's fucking... It's, and, you, and you actually see what's going on now, where before yeah, it was... Like, it was now everything, yeah. you, you know everything what's going on with all the interviews flat out on the fucking... on, on the YouTube and you, you, know, you know everything what's going on, you catch them in the mountain. It's just like yeah. what... And you think, oh, fuck me. You know, you think the fight's coming off and it's not coming off and, and then by the time the fight does come off, you're fucking sick of hearing about it. <laughs> class mate but we'll stay in touch mate like we always do and no um get some more work done soon bro yeah definitely mate Spot nice thought you look all right mate. Cheers, 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 mate yes people tell you what what a fucking fight that would be by the way gary fox versus robbie brown imagine that jeez that would be some fucking fight that but I uh, really appreciate everyone tuning in there. I'm going to put all Gary Fox's social media in the description. So make sure you go over there and start following his journey in the bare knuckle because this man is going to make waves. Good night. God bless everyone. I'll catch you.